C9 in for me here. Continuing our Mass Effect 1 Let's Play. Uh, this is going to be part 4, I believe. Uh, we just got talk done talking to uh, Bar Levon, trying to find out some dirt on Saren. He directed us to a Krogan we're about to go meet. We're also about to go find uh, Garrus, too, I believe. So, let's go to the map. Where would I need to go? Okay, CSEC HQ. That way, so from here... What would be quicker? I think just taking that ramp I came over would be quicker. Is this a way? See if I could sprint a little bit. And I was actually talking to my friend earlier, uh... When I was at work about how I'm doing this, and uh... His opinion, he feels I should be doing it on the PC version. But since I already have this on 360, I didn't feel the need to go and spend more money on something I already have, you know. Like, I had Mass Effect 3 for the PC, I believe. But I didn't get the rest of them. So, when I uh, bought the Trilogy 360, it was super cheap, it was like 30 bucks. You know, I was kind of like, eh, well, why not? So that's how I happened to be able to do this. So I'm happy with it. It's not the best. Obviously, PC quality would be much, much better. But I will not complain. To the Presidium. Allow okay, so where are we? Okay, so we need to go this way. Gotta keep my eye out for those keepers along the way, because it's a really easy task. Just, uh, pay attention. Is this the right place? Oh, yes, it is. Maybe. Try this again. Alright. I don't know what I'm supposed to be looking for on that, so I'm just going to stop. Commander Shepard, I didn't Let's expect to see you here. This guy has to say. Did Ambassador Udina send you? I came on my own. I need information. You humans are always so curious, always sticking your fingers into someone else's pie. Is that the right expression? Ah, uh, never mind. Forget I asked. Was there something you needed, Commander? I don't think there's really anything I need here. Let's see. What do you know about the Spectres? They're the right hand of the Council, or so they like to be called. More like the underhanded side of the Council. What do you it's have against shady. the Spectres? I can't abide any organization that considers itself above the law. Especially when it's left up to each individual Spectre to decide when and how to bend the rules. Sometimes you have to bend the law to keep people safe. I've been with CSEC for 30 years. I've never had to break the law to do my job, not once. Yeah, right. You expect us to believe none of your officers are corrupt? Damn, girl. There are over 200,000 CSEC agents. Some of them are going to be bad. But we don't turn a blind eye to corruption like the Spectres do. Tired. We do our best to find and punish any officer who breaks the law. Spectres. <laughs> They'll never come under that kind of scrutiny. The galaxy needs people like that. People who do the dirty jobs. Very true. I agree. But they need to be held to a higher standard. They need to be accountable. Saren's out of control. We both know that. But because he's a Spectre, the Council doesn't want to do anything about it. Is that the kind of person this galaxy needs? But not all Spectres are like Saren. True. But the potential is always there. I'll be going now. Goodbye, Commander. Okay. Not what I wanted to do. At all. Where is my destination? I'm 
so confused. Journal. Okay, um... Okay, CSEC Academy. Not Rex. Hard to miss guy. Where is he? Ooh. Keeper. Scan you real quick. That was a lucky little find. I may say so myself. I don't have time to talk yes. now. I'm Sitting at busy. a lounge. Busy, you say. This way. What in the world? What the hell is this? Oh, odd looking. Oh, another keeper. Eh, I'll take it. <sighs> Actually, before I do that. and CSEC Academy. Find one of those quick travel things and see what our destinations are. Welcome to the Presidium. Allow me to be your guide. Well, luckily these little signs help. A lot. Really? Really? I was over it the whole time. Okay. I guess since we're here, we'll see if we... Talk to Rex. Oh, Rexy boy. If you've never seen a Krogan before, you are in for a treat. How you holding up, Lieutenant? Not too bad. No headaches worth mentioning lately. Maybe I'm getting used to the strain. Maybe you've just got a good stress release. I know that knocking the geth on their synthetic asses gets rid of my headaches. My kind of girl. I cannot wait to get to three. Well, two for that matter. Two and three are my favorites. This one, I don't know, so far it seems okay. Two and three just, they picked right up. It was just so fun. It really did improve this game by like a million. Okay, let's look. Oh, here's Rexy boy. That everyone is a Krogan. Witnesses saw you making threats in Fist's bar. Stay away from him. I don't take orders from you. This is your only warning, Rex. You should warn Fist. I <laughs> will kill him. They're very blunt. You want me to arrest you? I want you to try. Go on. Get out of here. Yes, human. I'm trying to bring down Saren. Bar Levon said to talk to you. Bar Levon is a wise man. We may share a common Krogans goal are my favorite him. species out of all the alien races on this game. Enlighten me. I've been hired to kill the owner of Korra's den, a man named Fist. He did something very foolish. He betrayed the Shadow Broker. A quarian showed up here on the Citadel. She was on the run. She wanted to trade information for a safe place to hide, so she went to Fist. He promised to arrange a meeting between her and the Shadow Broker. Instead, he contacted Saren. Fist's no. not too smart. He's just greedy. Saren paid him a small fortune for the quarian. He had to. She has evidence connecting him to the Geth. If we get our hands on that evidence, we can prove that Saren's a traitor. And the Council will have to listen to us. Where's the Quarian now? Last I heard, Fist still had her. Probably somewhere inside his club. You help me kill Fist, she's all yours. 
I want to know more about your employer. Can't tell you much. All I got was a coded message with the details of the job. Standard procedure. What about Garrus, that Turian? He wants to take Saren down too. Oh, he yeah, might come in handy. He was here just before you showed up. Said he was going to follow up a lead on his investigation. Wanted to speak to the doctor at the med clinic. Move out. Oh yeah. Who do I want? Let's add Rex. Ashley. I'm not a big fan of Caden. I'll try to alternate when it gives me the option to. So it's probably gonna be like Ashley, Rex, Caden, and uh, Garrus. Seems right. But uh, I tweaked the settings in my capture card, so things might be a little bit more vibrant looking. Uh, it's still kind of washed out compared to what the actual game is. So I'm still tweaking settings. But it does, to me, looking at it right now, look better than uh, what it did in the previous videos. But anyways, now we got Rex, the badass Krogan. Now we need to... Let's see. Should we go talk to Garen? I need to go to Cora's den anyways. So let's see, where is that? Okay, so first we need to get out of the CSAC Academy. Let's go this way. Actually. Let's take me to Cora's den. Ah, I will. Sweet. Fast travel. Love it. Need it. Live it. Sweet. Gentleman's Club in the woods. I'm gonna see some freaky stuff in here, I have a feeling. I really wish they'd make like a Mass Effect movie series. Oh, we got a combat sequence here. Locked and loaded. Oh, buddy. Okay, I like these rounds a lot. Okay, yeah, these rounds are uh, sick, just to say the least. Okay, hey, Rex, you're kind of blocking my view here. These corrosive, these chemical rounds are pretty sick. Locked and loaded. I lost shield. Melting people with these things, man. I do like what they did in this game where your weapons don't take thermal clips like they do in the later. I'm on it. But they take a. Uh, the heat off. I guess that's what I'm trying to say. I'm trying to concentrate here. The accuracy of this pistol at the moment really sucks. Or maybe it's just my aim. I don't know. Either way, it was rough. Okay, so that's a fire extinguisher. I could have just blown that up, really. Look out! Stop right there. Don't come any closer. Yeah, I'm stuck on this wall. Rex just murdered. Everyone in here. Uh, is it the switch again? I 
Apparently it doesn't want to let me do a quick switch. There we go. Look out! Go, go, go! Okay, that was that was a bad choice on my part. surrender yeah smart move I almost died there that was bad where's the quarian she's not here I don't know where she is that's the truth he's no use to you now let me kill him wait wait I don't know where the quarian is but I know where you can find her the quarian isn't here said you'd only deal with the shadow broker himself face to face impossible even I was tell him Rex an agent Nobody meets the Shadow Broker, ever. Even I don't know his true identity. But she didn't know that. I told her I'd set a meeting up. But when she shows up, it'll be Saren's men waiting for her. Give me the location. Now. Here on the wards, the back alley by the markets. She's supposed to meet Great. them right now. <laughs> now we have to Make rescue her. Quarian. Rex gets straight. Drop the gun, Krogan. The Shadow Broker paid me to kill him. I don't leave jobs half done. I deserved it. A lot of people died because of him. He had it coming. Now let's move. We have to save that Quarian. Holy. Okay, uh, please tell me this stops. You know what? We're gonna do that after we save her. Uh, don't box me in here, please. Can I not open the door? Oh, this way. Oh man, there's so many people in this next room too. No can do. Come on, don't be a pussy. Throw doesn't work. They're behind an object. And I don't like the fact that he's hiding back there like that. I'm on it. I'm gonna die. That's so stupid. this again I keep forgetting I have like those nades or whatever but three and a half minutes they really don't give you a ton of time you sit and wait for one of those things to detonate uh, it's like glitching out Shep's dancing right this way this game's kind of buggy sometimes it, it can be annoying I'm going through Metagel like crazy. Him. 
still low on meta gel, which I do not like. At all. Uh, what can you do? It always seems to be me that gets hit. No one else, just me. This place is looking sketch. Oh great, assassins. I bet that's them. Yep. Did you bring it? Where's the shadow broker? Where's Fist? They'll be here. Where's the evidence? No way. The deal's oh, really looking dude. Those will be hilarious. They all dead? Just set me up. I knew I couldn't trust him. Don't worry about well, Fist. He you know what was coming to him. Then I guess there are two Quarian, things I need to thank bad. you for. Who are you? My name's Shepard. I'm looking for evidence to prove Saren's a traitor. Then I have a chance to repay you for saving my life. But not here. Yeah, we, we need do. to go somewhere safe. The ambassador's office. It's safe there. He'll want to see this anyway. So now we got Tally, too. You're not making my life easy, Shepard. Firefights in the wards, an all-out assault on Korra's den. Do you know how many... Who's this? A Quarian? What are you up to, Shepard? Doing my job. You wanted proof Saren's a traitor. This is it. Really? Maybe you better start at the beginning, miss... My name is Tali. Tali Zora Naraya. We don't see many Quarians here. Why did you leave the flotilla? I was on my pilgrimage. My rite of passage into adulthood. What kind of evidence did you find? How did you get it? During my travels, I began hearing reports of Geth. Since they drove my people into exile, the Geth have never ventured beyond the Vale. I was curious. I tracked a patrol of Geth to an uncharted world. I waited for one to become separated from its unit. Then I disabled it and removed its memory core. I thought the Geth fried their memory cores when they died. Some kind of defense mechanism. What did you find out? Off the minor details. Most of the core was wiped clean. But I salvaged something from its audio banks. How many tools? Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. That's Saren's voice. This proves he was involved in the attack. Is the conduit? He said Eden Prime brought him one step well, closer to finding the found conduit. Out before, so, any idea what that means? The conduit must have something to do with the beacon. Maybe it's some kind of Prothean technology, like a weapon. Wait, there's more. Saren wasn't working alone. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return Ooh, of the Reapers. Buddy. That don't sound pretty. I don't recognize that other voice, the one talking about Reapers. I feel like I've heard that name before. According to the Memory Core, the Reapers were a hyper-advanced machine race that existed 50,000 years ago. The Reapers hunted the Protheans to total extinction, and then they vanished. At least, that's what the Geth believe. Sounds a little far-fetched. The vision on Eden Prime. I understand it now. I saw the Protheans being wiped out by the Reapers. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods, the pinnacle of non-organic life. And they this believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. 
the Council is just going to love this. This is a lot to handle. They might just ignore everything we tell them. No matter what they think about the rest of this, those audiophiles prove Saren's a traitor. The Captain's right. We need to present this to the Council right away. What about her? The Quarian? My name is Tali. You saw me in the alley, Commander. You know what I can do. Let me come with you. I'll take all the help I we'll can We'll find get. out more about her later. Thanks. You won't regret this. Anderson and I will go ahead to get things ready with the Council. Take a few minutes to collect yourself, then meet us in the tower. Hmm. Let's get Hallie and Rex. Well, now seems like a great time, along with uh, the time this video is running, to end this episode here. Uh, we met Rex. Unexpectedly, we met Tally. I didn't think we've met her this early. Uh, you meet her here and there in two and uh, three once in a while. But, uh, yeah, so we'll actually get to find out more about her, Rex, and uh, Garrus from the beginning. But, uh, again, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, please subscribe, rate, well, I guess leave a like now. It would be favorite, share. Uh, I'll leave my Twitter in the description so you guys can follow me on that for latest updates and whatnot. Um, other than that, it's been C9 Infamy. Thanks for watching. Hope you come back and watch more. Hope you bring me some more viewers. It always helps my channel out. Uh, other than that, have a good night. Thanks for watching.